transparent. I got the broke glass blues. <laughs> Can you see my glass is broke? So am I. I ain't got no money to fix my broke glass. So I told my honey, I got the broke glass blues. Can you say broke glass blues real fast? <laughs> oh. <laughs> you can't copy around a blues. You can't copy around a blues progression. <laughs> Thank God. I'd have the copyright blues then, wouldn't I? What happened was the landscaper who mows the grass got excited and kicked a rock up. So I know you can't see very well because the light's screwing it up, but there's our new glass. This is my shop, my office area, the shop's back there. And um, so we're gonna take, let's, we'll take that out of the box and show you. I thought we'd just try to show you how we do this. I haven't actually done one of these in like 20 years, Baron. They don't, they obviously don't break that often. So these little tabs, these little filler pieces. Hey, <laughs> I thought that was gonna be hard to get out, Barry, since it had paint over it. But you basically take those off and these snap rings come out. All right, so now we're gonna go around, take the screws out. Let me show them what kind of screws. Just these little blunt pointed screws because they screw into the plastic on the other side there's no reason for them to have a real point to them so we can zoom in here it's out it's not all the way out <laughs> it's kind of pretty i almost want to leave it like that but it's not very energy efficient. And what's funny is I could feel the heat coming in yesterday <laughs> because you know, it's not insulated obviously anymore. And there's no argon gas. They put argon gas between these. All right, so now just easy, easy. The, the glass is not gonna come out. I wish okay. I could block the glass, the light here. Just take the snap ring off. If it falls out, no big deal. It should be, there should be a sealant holding glass in on the other side. Got some snap, that's why you got a snap ring, huh? Yeah, yeah. And now let's see if we can get a close up without. So bring that over here, Barrett, and we'll stand it up and lean it up against this door. And we'll see. Be careful now, those snap rings may not be attached too well to one side. So lean it right there and we'll see. If it's going to act the way I think it is, uh, we got to take the we got to take these screws out too. Interior room. Well, thank you. Well, the, <laughs> obviously you want to put the screws on the inside because the people would just come and unscrew your glass, right? So we're going to take these out. All right. So look, I'm just going to take this knife. You see what I'm doing? I'm just breaking the seal. I'm not cutting anything except the little. You see what I mean? Yeah. Right, so let me see if that's working. Yeah, that's working. I, okay. Yeah, just run it around. I've already got it loose pretty much. All we're trying to do is create a little crease for the paint. And try not to run the knife down the door. <laughs> Please. So Barry, just grab that side. And as I push out, now remember this is kind of broken, so do it easy. Yeah. There we go. Easy. Right, oh. You got? It. Don't let go. Okay. Oh. <laughs> Alright, now set this one over there and bring us the new one. There you go. We're trying to dispose of that without breaking it. Now set the bottom in. Now, 
Does it pretty much line up with the the old paint line? Okay, don't uh, uh, don't force anything. Okay, there we go. Okay, now let's get the bottom in. Is it in? I don't hit. Just gradual pushing. Is that the old one or the new one? New one. Okay. Alright, Barrett, you ready to run them in? Mm-hmm. Is that? Put your fingernail on the side over here, on the against the glass, and make sure that's mm. there's no gap. You see? That's better. Yeah, there's a there's a sealant. There's sealant on the outside, and it's that's what. Now don't let the don't let the tip of your screw your bit spin on the screw. Okay, you're just yeah. Check it with your fingernail. Yeah, it's pretty good. Interior room. That can come off. By the way, this is a Thermatrue door. These are really cool doors. They're not terribly expensive now. This door is. Uh, seven feet wide and eight feet tall. I can't really try to block. And it was meant, you can see out there we have like a little platform that acts almost like a loading dock. It's meant so I can wheel stuff out of the shop. We have a cart that we can wheel stuff out here and take it. Anything that's pretty wide, we can open up this other leaf over here. That looks good. I'm sure there's a torque that we're supposed to apply to those. We'll open the door in a minute, just make sure it's sealed good. Are they as hard to put in as they are to take out? <laughs> <laughs> what you do is you take the back end of a screwdriver, like the rounded edge of it. We'll go get one and you push it in. You need something that's kind of smooth and round to push them in. So you just need something that's got a, see? I'll we'll just leave them sticking out. <laughs> so get to it easier next time. The birds are singing. I got my broke glass fixed. Thanks, Barrett. There. Now I got the paint blues. I got to paint the door that we just fixed. Will my life never get easy? Or will it just be mixed? I got the paint blues. Keep <laughs> going.